Alrighty, what is up guys? It is currently Saturday morning and we are here at the Westminster Boys and Girls Club. We're going to be heading toward into the show right now, checking it out. I do have a table um, where I'm literally just going to be using for buying, I'm not going to be putting anything out. I just want to get some uh, get some deals. So that will be going on. Uh, we'll also be playing uh, hoops after the show. So that's the second thing that's going to be going on. I think our guy Kenny is coming down to play. And then number three is that I'm also working on a bulk deal. Um, the guy just sent me, um, added me on Google Sheets of all the inventory he has. We're gonna be trying to work that deal during the show as well. I brought my laptop, comp everything out and see what we can get done. So yeah, those are the couple things that are happening right now and going on today. And let's go and start heading into the show. Guys, one thing I forgot to mention too is Golden Auctions ends tonight and tomorrow. I think it's a two day, but there's an insane amount of stuff on there. Um, so that's also why I brought the laptop is to go through that stuff during, you know, the slower times. Just because when I checked last night and I was kind of going through the stuff that I wanted to make a play on, there's so much stuff at like, I mean, I'm sure it's going to go up, but there's just so much stuff at deal price points where it's just like crazy. Um, just because again, they have so much stuff ending at one time. Um, so that's why I brought the laptop. That's why I'm going to be going through that. And then again, kind of a timing thing. I believe Golden ends at like 6 p.m. tonight. So um, just got to be aware of that to make sure I put my uh, bids in, you know, of the stuff that I want to be able to get into extended. Now with all, like I talked about before where I was like, oh, like I need to make sure I put my bids in. It's because there's no extended bidding, right? For um, Golden, it's different. If you just have an initial bid in, you're good for extended bidding. Um, so you don't really necessarily have to have your max bid in. So that's something that we I don't have to worry about, which is cool. Um, so yeah, just wanted to keep you guys in the loop on on kind of the auction scene. All right, guys, pick up so far here at the show. We got Chen. <laughs> Tamar, Pop 1, R50, PSA 10, the Manning, which is off the Rad Ripper now. Oh, what up? And then a bunch of slabs. All right, guys, we just got done hooping. Yes, sir. We took some W's, took some L's. Kev got smoked. This guy took some L's. What? Two, two W's. All right, guys, uh, just finished with the B-ball. Um, super fun day, super productive day. Got a lot done, picked up a lot of stuff. I'm going to go home right now, and then we'll go through everything we picked up. Um, the biggest purchase, of course, was that DeMar DeRozan gold. Topps chrome gold out of 50 PSA 10. It is pop one. Ooh, getting a call there it is pop one guys many of you guys know the curry tops chrome uh bgs 95 gold just sold for five hundred seventy-five thousand. um so when i saw the damar just a beautiful card got a lot going for it didn't think it was going to show up at this type of show but it did uh made a play for it already got some crazy offers coming in so that's always cool but again just owning a, a card like that i just think is you know it's fun um so glad i got that again we're gonna head home guys golden is going on right now so i'm that's why I got the call in. I got a couple guys calling. We're gonna go after some cards. We'll see what we get. So yeah, we're, we're not done yet, um, but I'm gonna head home right guys. And then uh, I'll keep you guys in the loop of what we got going on. What is going on guys? Here are pickups from yesterday from the Westminster Boys and Girls Club show. So it's actually gonna be this box here, this box and this box. And then also we got that Damar Gold. Unfortunately for me, unfortunately for the buyer, it has sold. Uh, it sold late last night. I was, you know, negotiating with the buyer and we got a deal done. So the Damar, such a sick card. Out of 50, pop one, PSA 10. This is going off to the new buyer. But anyways, we have a bunch of new kind of raw inventory here. Actually, if you look to the side, we'll see we have a lot more, but adding it kind of to the pile. Wanted to just like give you kind of a peek of some of the stuff that's in here um it isn't necessarily anything that is of high value you know it, it was a bulk deal that that just made sense in terms of numbers there's some brady in there brady base brady base so yeah i think i paid yeah so for this box this box and this box it was 350 350 bucks so there's some homes in there so it just was something where like i knew that you know, I can move, you know, this stuff, kind of slow roll it. And once you kind of get your money back, then it's just inventory for me. 
Um, so yeah, I wasn't expecting to pick up more of this because again, like I got a lot already, but um, it just made sense. And then again, the Damar has sold. Uh, in terms of golden auctions, uh, we didn't win anything we went after last night, unfortunately, but golden also um, is going on tonight. Um, so I'm gonna keep you in the loop on that if we win anything there. What is going on everybody? Welcome back here. Uh, just finishing up with a Zoom meeting right now, last one of the day. And then we are on our way uh, to go to a couple shows. It is Wednesday here. So with Wednesday, we, was, we actually have three shows or trade nights now. We have Diamond Nine still. We have a new one at Average Joe's. And then we also have Frank and Sons, the Frank and Sons show. Uh, so the game plan today is to hit Frank and Sons first. Then we're gonna go to Diamond Nine and then we're gonna uh, end up at Average Joe's. So we got basically three things to do today. Um, Rad Ripper, Jared is coming with us as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and finishing up uh, my meeting here, which is in a couple minutes, so wish me luck. Um, and then we're gonna be on our way uh, to get some goodies. Also, quick update, I did buy um, a new F1 card. Um, this is going to be a, a hammy um, orange uh, variation. I'll put the picture right here for you guys to see. It is a PSA 7, again, with these F1 cards. They're super tough to get high grades. So a PSA 7 for this card um, is actually really, really good. So uh, that is a pretty big card in terms of the F1 world. Uh, and in terms of price, I mean, F1 cards are definitely not cheap, but um, definitely wanted to get one um, back. I am also currently buying the wax. So if you have Topps Chrome, uh, uh, specifically Topps Chrome, I am buying that. I'll also buy the Sapphire as well. Um, but really looking for Chrome right now. If you have sealed cases or loose boxes, send me a DM, send me an email. I am buying. That's what we, all we got going on today. That's what we picked up. And let's get uh, this vlog rolling. Diamond nine now. Frank and Sons to D9. Second stop. Diamond nine? That's me. Right, pretty That's terrible. Look at that beard. I told him I think mine's better. Right? Mine's better. Yeah. Yeah. You really need something. All right. Any strategy? We took an L the first game, so we're trying to get a W now. What was the score? Well, we're not from Ohio, so we won't play this every day. This is all you can do in Ohio. This is it. This is what they do for fun in Ohio. Mark, show your favorite uh, chalk, chalk, chalk toss. What was the score? 21 to 8. 21 to 8? All right, new game here, boys. Le LeBron us. Yeah! <laughs> That's bad. <laughs> Yeah, so How did it feel to get the first game? I mean, it felt great to have, you know, I want to thank my mother, my father, and, you know, just blessed to have a teammate like Mark. You know, he came a long way. They doubted us. He wants to thank Keith, Achilles Smith and Kajana Carter. That's money. That's money. Oh, fuck. I hate this game. Oh, 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 oh. Slide it in. That's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> do that thing you do. So get your hyped up. I got you. I got you. There you go. <laughs> What'd you say? They scored. They're up. What was that? Shit! <laughs> that was fucked up. 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 That was fucked up.
How we feeling, little boys? Good, man. National pizza about day, to right? feel stuffed in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of the game, Sasha? I'm so butthurt. What do you want to say? What that do you want good, to say? It was Mark? a good game. It was a great game. You gotta talk your shit a little bit. I'm not gonna talk shit. I'm just saying. You know what? I think I'll it could have gone either yeah. way. Take it could have gone either thanks. way if, the, if those you, boards weren't thanks. so bouncy. Isn't this you, where you either way we was whooping ass? Is that what you're saying, Mark? Pretty much. No, you guys won by <laughs> one point. That was some overtime shit. Oh, that was only the last game. I'm going to be very butthurt over the next couple two days. You like me, I hate losing. Bounciest I hate losing. Time. Sasha, you kept, Sasha kept balling. It no, I had one that bounced like three inches in the air and came back down. Yeah, that was Dude, you hit four in a row. Shout out to Diamond Nine for letting us play cornhole, cornhole after hours. Till 11 o'clock. Till 11 p.m. on a Wednesday. Cornhole. See, sometimes you go to card shows and you don't really do too much cards, <laughs> right? It's right. true, I bought two cards today. You never, never know what you would expect. What is going on, guys? Exciting day here. Uh, we got a couple things going on. Number one, we're going, I'm with Rad Ripper. What else, right? We're going to try to get into this Panini event. Uh, it seems like it's gonna have a lot of athletes, a lot of famous people um, in general. Um, so we're gonna try to get in there. It's in downtown LA. Um, that's where we're at right now. And then number two, is I'm buying an F1 sealed case. Uh, I gotta go to the guy's shop, which is around Burbank, I believe. And then number three is I gotta pick up that F1 hammy card that I was telling you guys about. So I'm gonna pick up that card. So we kinda got a lot of stuff to do in a short period of time. Hopefully we can get into the vent. We'll see what happens. Uh, but yeah, that's what we got going on today. Um, and enjoy uh, the vlog, here we go. We had our warm-up round. The next round is go round, baby. Oh, they work. My arm's getting tired. Three. Three. Gotta be 63, Jared. I got 63. <laughs> He's talking nice one. Three. Oh no. What? No! Oh, how is this still on? Oh. <laughs> I took the dub. <laughs> I took the dub. That's, the that's, dub. For, oh, that's, that's for cornhole. That's for cornhole. That's for cornhole. All right, guys, we just got here. We are in Glendale. It wasn't Burbank. It's Hunga. It's Hunga. Captain Fish Collectibles is actually right there. So we're going to head in there. We're going to get the case, do the deal, see what other inventory they have. I think our guy, Binder, is here from whatnot as well. So we just got to find him, or maybe he's already in there. So here we go. Let's see. All right, guys, we got to Burbank. I went inside, started talking to Rye, and what does he want? He wants my F1 case, so he told me to come bring it in. Let's see if we can work a deal with him. I really don't want to move it, but I'll move it at the right price, so let's see what happens. Interesting. How do you feel? I, I feel great. I feel, I, I, I feel great. Good. It's fantastic. I'm gonna uh, go put this case away, and we'll see it in uh, five years, Yeah. six years. Probably worth uh, five times what I paid for it. So I feel like it's a good investment. He's making fun of me right now, guys. Yeah, I mean, this is like a one of a, this is one of a fucking kind case here. <laughs> I mean, you're hyping it up now. After mine. you bought it. Yeah, I feel great. I feel great about the purchase. Okay, solid. Yeah, right, I'm glad. 10 out of 10 transaction with Sasha T. There you go. Always hooking it up. There Very you. fair. There you go. Definitely. <laughs> guys, look what Ryan just put on the box. Do not sell until 2025. That's funny. That's it. Good morning, guys. Uh, about nine o'clock here. What a day yesterday it was. Just such an unexpected kind of, you never know what you're gonna get type of day. Got a lot done. We were able to get into that event, which was amazing. Uh, we got that F1 case, which I really didn't want to sell, but it was Ryan. He gave me a fair offer and I was like, oh, might as well. Uh, but I know I'm gonna regret that. So that was kind of painful, but still, you know, you can never, you, you can never be mad, you know, making a little bit of money. And then I forgot that I didn't show you guys the hammy that we picked up. So the buyer or the seller dropped it off um, to Burbank for me so I could just pick it up. Beautiful hammy out of 25, Sapphire edition, PSA seven. 
Again, with these, they're so tough to grade. Um, that a seven is actually a pretty solid grade in my opinion. Um, so really stoked to pick this up. What is going on today? Uh, I got, there are more events going on in downtown LA. Um, one of my good friends invited me to uh, be his guest for an event tonight some type of bowling thing which there's going to be athletes uh there's going to be probably influencers i don't know i don't know what to expect i'm just going to show up so we're also going to be getting there earlier to uh go to this other event that has athletes and stuff i'm just in it for the ride i do have working on deals in la at the same time too we'll see what happens maybe we'll have them come to the event maybe i gotta dip out of the event go get the stuff and then come back um we'll see i don't know if we're going to be able to get some guys to sign stuff like literally i have no idea what's what's kind of going down i'm just in it to see what happens again a great way to connect with people that you wouldn't be uh normally be able to to talk to so uh another really uh we don't know what's going to happen type day uh, again we got the hammy um, i'm trying to get another case of f1 guys if these are guys are selling f1 cases loose boxes like i said before let me know and uh also big cards of f1 like this too so anyways let's get this uh vlog started um and i will see you guys soon guys to finish off this vlog i wanted to do two things number one do a recap of the stuff that i picked up that you guys weren't able to see and also what happened on friday on when when uh when i went out to those events so we'll do the events part first so friday um we did three things number one we went to uh the panini event once again um which was really cool and then uh we went to nfl experience and then the last thing we did we were uh my friend was invited as i mentioned before to this like kind of golden event and he brought me along i was i was with him as a guest and uh but was able to go to that it was really cool a lot of uh byron scott was there mike tyson was there a lot of other just big people were there uh it was a really cool experience a really great um, place to uh, connect with uh, people. Oh, fourth thing I did, we went to uh, the the wine event with uh, the Gary V's wine event in uh, downtown LA as well. So we did a lot that day. Um, but also during that day, we did get um, a couple deals done. There was two things that came in um, that I wanna show you guys right now. The first thing is this Rose Super Refractor. Uh, one of one from 2018 Topps Chrome Museum. So I did get this deal done. Um, on Friday and then it, it came in uh, I believe Saturday so this was a really cool one and I'm excited to get in I really like UFC stuff in general and I really like Rose um, so I'm trying to pick up as many of her one of ones as I can get so really cool one um, that I'm getting that I just got in um, if you guys watched the vlogs before you saw that I picked up one of her uh, prism black auto one of one so um, adding that uh, to, to the collection for her um, and then also we got uh, this Kobe uh, skybox premium 97 just a really cool card nothing like a crazy expensive but just uh just a cool card to get in i mean this stuff for me um especially here in in, in la and socal moves um really quickly now the third card i show you guys is just something that came in last week i don't think i i, I showed it in any of the vlogs um so here it is edwards uh orange prism sgc 95 uh this is number 49 Ed edward's stuff has been kind of going crazy lately literally if you bought his stuff like before the season started you would have came out doing pretty pretty well so that's another one again just you know this sort of stuff always moves well and then this is a card that i've actually bought like last year but i haven't really shown you guys or at least i don't think i have you've probably seen it but i haven't really talked about it too much um lebron kobe dual auto on card auto number to 25 just a beautiful beautiful card um you don't see these pretty much anywhere so i had the, i had it in the box over here and i was like dude i don't think i've really talked about this card too much so i wanted to show you guys that um as well and then the other things we got in which you guys already know about is the khabib and the hammy so that's kind of what we bought um over the you know last uh, week or so uh, we did get the f1 case that unfortunately has moved i am i'm navigating to find more but wanted to kind of explain this little last bit of the vlog for you guys um and send you guys off a little bit more of an understanding so anyways i appreciate you guys thank you for tuning in uh, more vlogs are on the way and i'll see you guys next time